last sample problem just to make sure we've got it. Find the maximum height. A quarter kilogram baseball is thrown upward with an initial speed of 30 meters per second. Neglecting friction, no air resistance, the maximum height reached by the baseball is approximately what? So we're looking for a displacement here. All right, we're going to call up the positive direction because that's the way the ball goes initially. Our initial velocity is 30 meters per second. Final velocity, when it reaches its highest point, must be zero. Another known that we have there. We're trying to find delta y. Acceleration is negative 10 meters per second squared. Negative because we called up positive. The acceleration due to gravity is down. And we don't know time. Let's choose a kinematic equation that's going to help us out. I want delta y, so I'm going to use v squared equals v initial squared plus 2a delta y. Rearrange this for delta y, and I get v squared minus v initial squared over 2a. Therefore, delta y equals well, v squared, that's going to be 0, minus v initial squared, 30 squared, all over 2 times my acceleration, negative 10. That's going to be negative 900 over negative 20, or 45 meters. These kinematic equations are terrific tools for problem solving, but you've got to remember they can only be used in situations of constant acceleration. Make that table a v initial, v, delta x or delta y, a and T, and when you know three of those quantities, you can always solve for the other two. Hopefully that gets you a great start. Thanks for watching educator.com and make it a great day.